Hi, I'm Colin. And I'm Peter. And this This is Living Living Miracles What's New for October October 2017. And in some big events news for Living Miracles, we have the return of the Strawberry Fields Music and Enlightenment Festival. and Peter, you had a chance to uh, to catch up with uh, Kirsten and Ricky. Yes, I did. We had a very beautiful conversation. It's very exciting. So we'll show you a little bit of that now. Great. So I am here with Kirsten and Ricky, and we're going to uh, talk about Strawberry Fields Festival for 2018. What can people expect? from the Strawberry Fields Festival and is it going to be similar to times before for those who have been to it before? Yeah, I was feeling something very new for this strawberry. There's some part of it that's quite different. In the first strawberries we had a lot of uh, focus on the participants having the opportunity to get up on stage and face their fear of singing and watching the self-concept and you know, judging themselves and kind of moving past that and letting the singing come through them and it was beautiful everyone loved it but this year uh, the focus actually now is that we have these amazing singer-songwriter musicians and uh, we're inviting them to actually come and take the majority of the festival. We're gonna have some top-notch musicians that really take you to a place of wonder. Mm. And you know who's what the lineup is so far? Oh, is that a <laughs> developing? <laughs> <laughs> we do, but we're kind of keeping a little bit of mystery. Okay. <laughs> and we're going to just release um, release the, the musicians over the coming months. Okay. Other than those that we do know, of course, Ricky mm-hmm. <laughs> um, will be there. And Eric, uh-huh. uh, Emily, Emily, okay. Emily Warwick. So we have Emily is an amazing opera singer. And she's our choir coach. <laughs> <laughs> she's awesome. Yeah. Everyone who's going to be singing is deeply in touch with the Chorus and Miracles, and it's their passion. And the music comes from their love of God, from their experience with God, and quite often brings you into your own experience with God just from listening to the music. Yeah, David's gonna be there with some very, very deep sessions. Kirsten will do satsangs with her music. Mm. Such a beautiful location too as well, like to just Mm. be totally immersed in this experience of the music and just the deepening and with the talks and satsangs too, I think it's just gonna be a gorgeous event. (laughs) Mm, Yeah, yeah. The the essence of Strawberry, like even the name, Strawberry Fields Forever, and everyone knows that the name of that song and everyone can resonate with Rumi, Mm -hmm. you know, with the field, Mm -hmm. which is a state of mind or a state of awareness that's beyond judgment, beyond right and wrong, I will meet you there. And that is the spirit speaking to our heart and it's where we all want to be (laughs) all the time. And so the festival, really the core of the whole festival is about opening to that experience of coming into the unified field Mm -hmm. together. So as well as having some big name musicians, you say, are there any other ways people can participate when they come? Yeah, we will have a uh, wonderful musician, singer, songwriter there. I won't give her name away, but she is, um, loves to involve everyone in singing. So we will definitely have opportunities there for everyone. There'll be dance sessions for everyone to participate in. I know a lot of our friends are really good singers and musicians and they love to have the opportunity to come together and jam so there'll be those jam session opportunities beautiful okay well yeah to find out more about the event we have a new website we have uh, strawberryfieldfestival.com if you go along to there you can check out our new page we have for the event and also we have a facebook group called strawberry fields music and enlightenment festival and you can also find the uh, the group by going to the going to the page I just mentioned, and there's a link at the bottom to go directly to the group. And um, yeah, more information coming very soon. So thanks, Kirsten, and thank you, Ricky, very much for coming to talk to me. Oh, thanks, Peter. <laughs> <Thank you. laughs> we will meet you there. See you in the field. See you in the field. <laughs> And 
and Colin. We have David. He's traveling. He's traveling again, doing retreats. Yeah, um, for our South American friends um, and those that might be in the area in late November. David's going to be in Colombia from November 24th to the 26th. There's an event there. And then uh, in Sao Paulo, Brazil, uh, from early December, December 1 to December 3, uh, David will be uh, offering an event there as well. So if you're in the area, um, it'd be a great, great opportunity to get along and, um, and see David uh, speak there. David's travels will be winding down, so take this rare opportunity to see him in person. Or for the Brazil retreat, you can join online. It's going to be in English with Portuguese translation. We actually have a, a great uh, special on as well. If you visit our, our store, you can purchase the Unwind Your Mind ebook mm -hmm. and you'll get a bonus MP3 of quite a famous talk in this community is a talk called Undoing Linear Time. Or the Noodle Talk. The Noodle Talk, <laughs> yeah. So I also recommend that you check that out. Yeah, so we've been having some regular Saturday night moves. We've had another, another bottler on Saturday night. Pete, mm -hmm. you've got some news for us on... Yeah, it was another great night. We've been doing these potlucks and movie nights like every weekend for, a, it seems like the past month or longer now. So they're fantastic talks. We're also really happy that we're putting it all up on Spreaker. So if you can't come along to our event in Mexico, um, just go along to our Spreaker website and we'll put that link up on the screen too. And if you just um, check out David's latest episodes, you'll see a whole bunch of different movies he's given great talks on. And uh, it's all for free. It's fantastic material, deep metaphysics. So check it out. Also, last time I mentioned David is going to be at the uh, ACIM conference in San Francisco next year in 2018. So um, if you haven't checked out the information for that yet, um, go along to acim-conference.net and I'll put the link on the screen. And from there, you can um, go to the link where you can sign up for the conference and be sure to select David Hofmeister as the teacher who inspired you to enroll. Thanks so much everyone for joining us and hasta luego from, from Chapala. Chapala. <laughs>